Hi, this is Porter Thorndike, and I'm going to take you through how to create the stacked bar sales by month and product category sample located inside retail samples charts folder. The stacked bar chart is amazing. I love it. It looks beautiful. It's also very effective at communicating information. When would we use it? In this case, this is communicating revenue by month, and we're using product category as the color by. So this would be very effective. You want to use a bar chart over a time series anytime you want to compare one period to another. That's more effective than a line, which is better at communicating the pattern. And you can also use a color by like product category to stack it. If you want to get a rough approximation of how the values of that dimension have changed over time, it's not going to be uh, the best at showing the pattern. It's not going to be perfect at showing you the change. There would be better ways to do that, but it is very effective at communicating that data over time as a rough approximation and allowing you at the same time to compare one period to another. How would we create this example? We're going to start in chart mode and we're going to select stacked bar as our chart type. We go to the other button and we select the stacked bar. And now what we want to do is just drag the metric of choice onto the canvas, in this case, revenue. And now we want to drag on our horizontal axis, which in this case is sale month. Okay. And now we can also use color in different ways in terms of the stacked bar. So if we wanted to see which months have sold the most products, we could actually use a metric and that would give us a heat scale. And that would be very interesting. And we can also use a dimension which we did in the sample, which we used product category. And that's how we get our stacked parts as easy as that. And just for fun, let's take a look at what this would look like with a different dimension, which we can do by removing product category. I might be interested in how the store sales by region have broken out. And this has been creating the sales by month and product category sample.